Here's day 18. And it looks like a boot. What up, you guys? It's your boy, Cool Rapper. Here? I almost thought that was gonna fall on me. We're here doing a review slash unboxing on the Jurassic World Dominion. Dang it, I forgot what it was called. Capture and Crush Truck. Now, we didn't see a Raptor like this in Dominion. But we did see a vehicle in Dominion that looks similar to this truck. Let me see if I can find the clip. Let's show me unboxing this figure. I'm pretty sure you guys are guessing. You didn't finish unboxing. There's still stuff here. I'm going to unbox that right now. All the reason I didn't is because I wanted to show off how pretty this looked first. We got a... Uh, Five pieces here. The chains that go on the truck. A little missile for the launcher thing here. Might be putting it in wrong. I am. And a piece to the truck. So this piece goes on here like so. And the gun, you can put it on here or you can put it on the side right here. Heck, if you want to, you can put the crane thing like right here drive by to capture a dinosaur. It'd be like, we caught him. Now let's chain him up. If I can figure out how to put the chains on first. Oh, there we go. We got one chain on, now we got the other. There. Now this dinosaur ain't going nowhere. Thanks to our capture vehicle. I think we could put the gun here for like a person to go on. Here's one of my mercenaries. Ah, a perfect little spot to put your little mercenary here. Actually, there's little posts inside. Look, inside the truck, it's got these little pegs right here. Which are perfect for the ball to feed on your character, so you can put them in. Right, check this out. I'm a ballerina! Alright, you're making a fool of yourself. Now let's put this part right here. There, now he's ready to shoot any dinosaurs that come by. Don't take any chance right now. Put this thing back where it originally was. It can stay right there in case we need it. Now the truck itself is kind of small compared to what you expect. Here's Claire next to it. Don't, don't expect the truck to be that small, don't you? How oh, it feels like it should be that big compared to her. Oh, I forgot. This thing can shoot dinosaurs. Let's get Rexy here. Rexy running on a rampage. And our mercenary here, fire! Arrgh! Rexy's down. Now we can relocate her to the Biosyn Sanctuary. And the truck's got this button right here in the middle. So if a dinosaur like attacked it, this would happen. Oh no, they're gonna get everyone inside. Ah! Oh, the humanity. Ah! Just kidding, there's no one inside. Wait. Wait, if there's no one inside, then how's the truck going? Oh, this is a fancy looking truck here. 
Hello. Uh oh. <laughs> and it's also got the same thing on this side. So if a dinosaur rammed into it. <laughs> I broke your truck! <laughs> Dang you stupid raptor, that's gonna cost a lot to fix the repairs! So yeah, the truck can come apart. Oh man, this it didn't want to come off. Get the mercenary out. Put him on the gun instead. There, now it makes sense. Now I got the mercenary on top. And I think we'll put this thing on the... Right here, yeah. Let's fix up the truck. Yay, yeah, the truck has been repaired. Now we can go hunt for some dinosaurs. So the chains that go on this thing, they're made of a rubbery type of material. So you can just put them on and take them off easily. I'm pretty sure we saw a vehicle that looked just like this in Dominion. Or at least I did. It's got some big old tires here. And it can roll. It can roll just like this guy. Oh, since we're here, here they are compared side by side. So the truck doesn't come with any human characters. It only comes with a raptor. And this raptor does look pretty cool. Love its yellow eyes, its orange patterns, and its dark purple body. While I was in the packaging, its arms were like this, like it was praising. Oh, praise me, God. I want you to give me your almighty praises. But I think you can fix that by just heating up the plastic and holding that joint in place till it's not warped anymore. I might paint the claws though. What color do you think would suit the claws of this raptor? And just like those other dinosaurs I've reviewed, he's got the code. Scan the code. Scan it! Might as well since we're here. And we have unlocked a new Velociraptor. Oh man, his patterns actually look better on here than they do on the actual figure. <laughs> I mean, look at it. Check it out, he's got more orange on him. And there's also a code on the truck that you can scan. Get it in the shot here. I did it! Alright, now what a down lock. I'm not sure what that was supposed to do, but at least I scanned the code on here. I think we fooled around long enough, let's compare this to some stuff. Alright, so here's the truck next to some human characters and Owen on the motorcycle. Here it is next to some other dinosaurs, another raptor, the Mortha, Gallimimus, a Triceraptor, and Carnotaur. Oh, almost forgot. Here it is next to Dilophosaurus here. You know what? Let's bring in some other dinosaurs in. We got Triceraptors, other raptors, Dilophosaurus. Actually, Carnotaur wasn't. I'm just bringing in dinosaurs that were created by Biosyn, and I'm pretty sure we're in the Biosyn Valley. The only raptor that was in Biosyn was a uh, beta but maybe there's some other raptors hiding in the biosim valley maybe and i'm pretty sure that the atrocity raptors were created by biosim so we got a biosim team on patrol here scouting the area for any escaped dinosaurs then all of a sudden bam some raptors start attacking them start attacking them Oh no, the raptors are attacking, we gotta fight back! And then, Atrociraptors show up! It's Red and Panthera! Red goes at a raptor, and Panthera fights the other raptor! Oh my gosh, this is an epic battle here! Biting at each other's necks! The man turned in the gun doesn't know what to do! Then all of a sudden, ah! Dilophosaurus! Ah! <laughs> my gosh, what a fight this is! Oh no, they broke off part of the truck! And just when the guys thought I couldn't get any worse, the T-Rex shows up! 
starts attacking the car. And now Panther starts attacking a T-Rex. So gush, chaos, and pandemonium everywhere. My gosh! Oh! I'm pretty sure you guys get the picture here. See y'all later. Bye.